Before you can create a user account, you must have a role to assign to the user. Roles are assessed through Administration, Settings, and under the general heading, Roles. There are four default roles. Administrator, with full permissions to the book. Limited, with only view permissions. Super user, which has the same permissions as an administrator, except for the ability to edit other users' details. And support, which can be enabled to allow application support to be enabled. In most cases, you'll need to create a role to shape it to the needs of your user in your business. To add a new role, click on Add. Give your role a name, like Accounts Receivable Clerk, and a brief description, like Enter and Review Invoices. Now you are ready to define the exact permissions for this role. In this case, to enter invoices and adjustment notes, view customer details and past transactions. To make these selections, open up each section that mirrors the tabs of the program. Open the day-to-day -day section. The invoices will select the view, create an edit, and print and email permissions. Notice that a yellow partial circle appears to the left. We'll select the same permissions for customer adjustment notes. For receipts, we'll select view. Under reporting and customer reports, we'll select all for invoice list. Notice a green full circle appears to the left and view for customer transactions. In list reports, for customer list, select all. In contacts, select view for contacts. The permissions for this role are now set. You can assign this role immediately to a user in users currently assigned. Select the user and click add. Now at the top of the screen, click on save and close. You can now see the new role in the roles list. To see a brief overview of the assignments to this role, click on Show Details. Thank you for watching this video, and if you have any questions, please go to reckon.com forward slash support.